Oh. Yeah, this could very well be uh, Tempest Stay to take uh, first place in this tournament. Um, that would be just awesome completing, to see. completing this first objective is really all they need to do. Um, so we've got, uh, what is it, uh, eight <laughs> minutes on the first objective? Seven minutes, eight minutes, ten minutes? I can't remember. I've played this game so much and I don't know how much time's on this first objective. Ten minutes, I think. They're asking what happens if Foucher DNFs Tempest on 39 peasants. <laughs> <laughs> what do we do? <laughs> Comes down to vigor at that point. Who has the most <laughs> vigor? Oh, yeah. Come down to Kendo. <laughs> finish. No, I'd find it. I'd find it hard with the uh, with just the momentum that Tempest has had through this tournament. I, I would be really surprised if they didn't finish this objective, um, and that uh, Faust was able to hold him off as well as uh, as as Tempest did. That that was just an amazing hold. You rarely really see. I mean, when two clans get together, you rarely see the hold happen on this first objective. You rarely see that. I mean, this is uh, that was pretty incredible, actually takes a lot of communication. I would just wonder like what was going on in Tempest's uh, uh, team speak there while they were doing that, but just incredible coordination and communication. Just keeping track of everybody that's moving on the field, mm -hmm. where, the, uh, where the danger is. Oh yeah, just absolutely. One moment, just mm -hmm. one moment on that objective of disorganization can completely throw it off, off your defense. So... Oh yeah, Tempest has just been spot on in every aspect. Like in the in the the Dark Forest game before this one, they pushed and pushed and hustled like hell in the offense, um, and in the defense they they stalled Fauscher just so so much they kept them down the whole time. That ten second cart on the first objective for Fauscher was what pretty much spelled their doom, and they they completely repeated that on the first round in this game. Holding them to the last second last with second. one peasant remaining. Very, very good good team play. Not to say Fauci has been doing bad. Um, but, yeah, I'm just seeing a bit more hustle from Tempest. And their momentum is just chugging along. Despite coming out of the loser's bracket. Like we're still in a bit of an intermission. They're both taking a bathroom break. Yeah, I saw Skills say that, so I went for one of my own. Sorry about that. So wait for a minute. As we zoom out to look at the map, it looks effectively small. And um, actually, on this objective uh, earlier today, when I was watching uh, when I was watching Tempest play on Stonesill, uh, Quasi was a big factor in uh, in getting through this first objective. Um, just as uh, Tay Ripper mentioned, they were actually able to do it in a minute and 56 or 57 seconds. Quasi pushed up the right side, took out uh, the 1v1 knight situation he was dealing with, um, had two more reinforce on him, able to clean those guys up, and then uh, pushed forward, uh, took out the two huts on the right, um, which is, uh, he, well actually, he took out the far right hut, the one coming, the, the one closest uh, to that one, and then the the main one in the center there, hitting both sides of that, cleaning up a few more peasants, running all the way around the back, getting a couple more of the huts back there, and uh, getting at least like seven more peasants on that side, just in the first uh, in the first push for Quasi. So he uh, he had a huge play in that match, and uh, he you... definitely mm -hmm. was the 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 one that uh, got that time for Tempest on the first round. I mean, yeah. he had a big part in that. You're talking about Rosie versus Tempest, the one before. Yeah, was it Rosie? Streaming. I w it was Rosie. I'm pretty sure, and I I saw it. You you're absolutely right. They they just completely flanked the hell out of Rosie. I'm def I'm pretty sure it was Rosie. Um, and they just tore him apart. That two minute first objective, it was insane. 
So it's going to be good to watch. I mean, I think basically what happened was, uh, you know, Quasi went forward a little bit on that right hill and kind of just ducked behind a tree for a moment. And then I think uh, Tempest drew a lot of uh, the other team's eyes over towards them and then gave Quasi the go-ahead. He went in and <laughs> he did his job. <laughs> he did his job well. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, Tempest. Like I said, the individual skill of the Tempest members and the Fauscher members on that note are, are is exemplary, like insanely so. Uh, but I've been seeing, like you said, a bit more individual um, initiative coming out from Tempest. Like you said, they're, they're flanking a lot more of their own accord. They're coordinating, however, at the same time, which is very, very helpful and basically makes it work. And that's how they got the two-minute objective with the match with Rosie Boys. Well, when it really comes down to play at the highest level, I mean, communication is very important. Even just calling out things like like spawn times or how far you are away from somebody or being accurate and uh, just calling out your targets and who's where just to create that overall sense of awareness and synergy. Uh, you can have synergy with your players just uh, out of, you know, just naturally playing with them and stuff, but communication doesn't really hurt that at all. And uh, I, I can just imagine what's going on through, uh, through the... Uh, through the voice channels there on Tempest's end, and um, I'm sure they're they're just coordinating really well over the mic. So, mm -hmm. yeah, I can imagine the Tempest team speak is just calm, core, cohesive, really, really nice. Um, probably the same with Fauscher, but somewhat less so. I don't know. <coughs> uh. All right, so all the all the players of up. Tempest are ready at this point, still mm -hmm. waiting on about three on Falsher. Um, you know, poops might take longer than sh pisses, you know? I don't know. But the anticipation is killing me. It's killing me. Yeah, um, I, I'm obviously you know a little bit biased here. I'm trying not to be in the commentary, uh, but you know Tempest, they're my boys, and uh, I, I'm not afraid to say it. I want to see them win this one, take one home for our uh, oh, for so our much. for our team. So I'm definitely excited to see this round personally. Um, I got to play with our uh, our second squad of Tempest. Unfortunately, I have uh, I had like. For the for the third match, I had uh, schoolwork to to do. It, it could have been uh, instead of uh, instead of Tempest playing uh, against the Rosie Boys, and I'm not even sure if that's who they played, but <laughs> I think it is. I, think uh. it was. I guess <laughs> I, mean, I think so. Um, oh, I can look at the fucking bracket. What am I? Yeah, we could. <laughs> I but I know you, win, play, you but, played us. I know yeah, I played. I played against you guys, and uh, I think oh. we played against we played against Sin as well. I was in there for both of those, but then it, I had to get schoolwork done before eight o'clock, and I actually finished it at like seven thirty. So, made it just by the wire. I think it may have been Nemesis actually. I believe it was because that was their last match before fighting. Nemesis, Foster. yeah. I I, I yep. knew it wasn't Rosie Boys because I would have I would have definitely remembered that and I would have actually like known some of the names on Rosie Boys because I haven't seen them play yet at all today. Or so I didn't see them at all in the tournament. Um, so I, I don't really know what they're about. Um, Ooh, but... I I I streamed a couple of their matches yesterday and today. They have actually been really really on top of the competition. Um, they got all the way to the match with Nemesis at the end of the losers round, which is really impressive, um, considering uh, who they had to go up against. They actually beat Tempest two in the losers bracket, which is a pretty good, pretty good feat. It's because I wasn't playing, man. It's because I wasn't playing. Right, right, right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's Clay. I wasn't playing, man. And Syndicate oh, lost quick. because I wasn't playing. <laughs> Real quick, true, Sir Yak, if they're true. not playing uh, this yet, what's going on is there's a slight intermission. Somebody's pooping? I don't know. Yeah, so. Bodily yeah, yeah. fluids? It's kind of a uh, bathroom break kind of situation. I'm going right to go now. grab another uh, water. <laughs> I'll be right back. Oh, oh, uh. What? Everyone's what? saying say update, Falcher not playing second round. That doesn't make any sense. Good job. Good job. GG guys, congrats on the tourney. We're not going to play this out. Oh. Uh, I have work in 10 minutes. 
<laughs> Shit, Tyrant has work in 10 minutes, so they can't play. Oh. Oh shit, Tempest won! Oh, that, that Are you kidding sucks. me? Yeah, they win. Are you kidding me? Nope. This first objective will be over in 10 minutes. Nope. We have, we have 72 it, it's viewers only 10 minutes. for a prolonged uh, bathroom break. I don't, I honestly don't see Tempest taking it, re I mean, I honestly don't see Faustro taking it regardless. Um, shit, they son. They can't put a sub in? Nope. Not today. Uh, it's, it's, it's done now. Uh, They're leaving. Either way, good, you know. Uh, oh, oh God! The fucking Antis! You gotta be shitting me, dude. <laughs> You've gotta be kidding. I'm so sorry about saying shitting me, but you gotta be shitting me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I want to see it too. It would've been awesome, but shit happens. Wow! All right. Well, that was a uh... first round. Was cool. Uh... <laughs> It's almost 11 o'clock at night. Who's going to work right now, man? I think they're... It's Sunday night, dude. It is Sunday night. Who is going to work at freaking oh, 11 o'clock, man? Who's going... Uh, well, oh, way, well, good fights from everybody. Clay's just sour. He didn't get to... You know. Clay's sour. Yeah, Clay's yeah, sour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone in chat, hashtag Clay sour. Sour oh, Clay. Yeah. Clay sour. Yeah, Clay sour. Yeah, Clay sour. <laughs> Damn. I mean, everybody should be sour, man. We all wanted to watch this game. I wanted to watch it. Anyway, well, I guess for uh, <laughs> for, for my closing remarks, I'll do it first since I'm a blabber. Uh, I just wanted to thank uh, Height for organizing another tournament, all the teams that played into it, and uh, all the new clans that are forming and increasing the uh, the NA competitive mm -hmm. scene, man. A lot of a lot of new names out there. Not necessarily new players, but there are new players too. Uh, new clans and new players. So we're seeing a lot of different variety and uh, people uh, joining the ranks of the competitive league and chivalry. So that'll be good. Um, hopefully, you know, Torn Banner can uh, maybe come out with a patch at some point, and we'll see some uh, non-caveman kind of strategies. But this has been interesting. It's been a really fun tournament. Thank you guys for in, um, having me uh, co-cast with you guys. Uh, it's been fun for me. And, uh, yeah, just thank all the players. Thank mm -hmm. Hype, Lapu, everybody mm -hmm. for getting it organized. And uh, that's uh, pretty much it for me. I'll see you guys on my stream on Fridays. Twitch TV, Sir underscore Clay. I pretty much stream every Friday. Okay? Yeah, hit him up, guys. He's cool. He's a good guy. Um, on, yeah. on to you guys. So, I'm done. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Right. <laughs> so he pretty much did the good-ass outro. Good is true. Um, this is indeed the end of the tournament. Tempest has taken it in an astounding forfeit from uh, Fauscher. Although, you know, I probably would have called it for Tempest regardless. Would have been an interesting round, but they won. Uh, that's that. Again, thanks, Height. I can't emphasize that enough alongside Clay. He's such a beast for making this tournament, allowing me to stream and, and, and Clay... Um, it was a blast, absolutely great experience.